Day three, Sunday. It's gonna be the last day. I was gonna do another coat on these, but I'm kind of liking the way they are. This one's a little lighter than that other one. Just uh, fixing a couple of my screw ups right here. I had some drippage, so I'm going over that one more time. And here, uh, this is one of the last panels I did because um, it was already cold. Kind of um, didn't work out good for that. And here, time to put the LA, possibly Dodgers right here on the side. So that's good. So we're at this step now. Went in, already put the screws for all the side panels. The side panels done. I did the pre drills on all of them on the side. This is how it looks. I went in and I did, um, I painted all these screws. Black uh, is, uh, would seem to kind of look better. Thanks to the wife for telling me to do that. <laughs> I was gonna do gray. And uh, this is blue. Originally I was gonna do blue there, but uh, white looks good too. So did the pre-drills on the top. Did that. This is, it's gonna fit. So let's pop this open. Man, just put some glue right there. Uh, so word of advice, I painted all the panels. I thought, okay, the back panel, back port, the top, the bottom, except I forgot about this. This actually, you can see through it if you look through the port. So I, I, I wasn't gonna put any more Keta dye. I was done. So I used some Herculiner, Hercule, this stuff. This is good stuff. It, it doesn't clog up. And it, um, it, it's pretty tough stuff compared to the other stuff. The, that Krylon stuff is no good. And I think the Rust-Oleum would be the only other one I would use. So um, there it is. Now you can look back there and it's black. So let's put some glue. Uh, next is uh, screw inserts for the sub. And then let's fire up. This might take a couple more days, but uh, we're, uh, we're getting somewhere. 